Hey gang, Bronco Carl 92 here. So it's Saturday, February 15th. Today I'm going to show you how to make a roof rake to get the snow off your roof. Alright, so there's my shed. There's a lot of snow on the roof. And, uh,. We're supposed to get some more snow today, and um, I need that shed to last, and I don't want the roof to collapse. So there's about two foot of snow on there, and it's wet and heavy. So uh, let me get down to the garage, and I'll show you what I'm going to do. All right, so anyway, here's the roof of the garage. Um, I made my preliminary version of the, uh, the rake yesterday, and um, the handle on it's a little too floppy. So I went and got a, a piece of EMT, and, uh, which is much stiffer. and. Uh, I'm gonna put the rake together, and then uh, we'll uh, we'll take care of the shed, and then this roof, and uh, that roof up there. You can see how how thick that snow is, and uh, there's a layer of ice. If you look, you can see that line. That's actually like a half inch layer of ice from uh, the storm we had uh, like a week ago. So, anyhow. Let me get you down. Alright, so shop. what I have here, I have a 10-foot length of 3 quarter inch EMT uh, pipe. Um, I have a 4-foot uh, piece of uh, 3 quarter by 8 inch uh, flat stock. Uh, I got some rubber bumpers there, one for the end of the handle, some hardware, a clamp, and uh, the scoop. And what that is, is that's a, a piece cut out of a, um, an oil barrel, oil drum. And I've already welded... Um, the connector on here uh, that will connect the pipe to that. So what we're going to do is we're going to we're going to take this uh, flat stock here. We're going to cut that in half. We're going to make uh, two supports to go from that edge and that edge to the center, and then uh, we're going to attach the uh, the pipe to that fitting. So uh, let me cut some stuff up, drill some holes, and. Uh, Put your okay, back so here we are mocked up. What I did was I uh, took that flat stock, I cut it in half, I drilled a 3 8 hole on one end of each side, and a, a quarter inch hole on the other side. And then I took the, uh, the vise and I bent them over like that. It's kind of about a 45 degree angle. And uh, now what we got to do is just drill uh, two holes in the, uh, in the blade there, and uh, bolt it together. The clamp over here, is a water pipe clamp. It's like a strap clamp with the with the threaded hole. Um, I was looking for some sort of clamp, I guess, that I could attach everything to the center of the EMT here, and uh, that seemed to do the job. It was about a, a buck and a half, so we'll see how well that works. So let's uh, let's drill some holes. Now, bolt this on. I think it's a good idea to use these big fender washers to spread the load Put one on each side of the, the scoop there. And then a lock washer and a nut. So you're probably wondering, well, why are you building a roof rake instead of just going out and buying one? Well, yeah, they do sell them, but I probably have a better chance of finding one of them in Florida than I do around here right now. No one has them. Side. 
So I've got about $14 in material on this. The uh, piece of barrel I had when I made my barbecue. I guess that's what I cut the door out of. I need the plates out of it. That's why it's cut that way. All right. So uh, last thing I got to do is uh, tighten this up. I don't have a wrench out here, so let me go grab a wrench and I'll uh, be back in a sec. All right. So job done. So I tightened up that clamp and that uh, bolt over there. I want to show you a little detail of. Sorry about that. How I have uh, this part attached in here. So, like I said, this is just a three-quarter inch um, uh, EMT electrical connector. Um, actually, I welded it in there to make it stronger. If you don't have a welder, it's not a big deal. You can just, uh, you know, use a, a nut on here. So, what I did was on the inside, the bolt goes all the way through, and there's a nut actually up here. And then I have a jam nut over here to sandwich this in here because this thing actually roof rakes take actually a lot of a lot of punishment. So um, let me get you set up and uh, let's start pulling some snow off the roof of the shed. All right, looks like it works. Let me get finished up, put you back on. All right, so, uh, yeah, we got all the snow off the roof. Man, that's a lot of work. So uh, anyhow, I'm gonna go, uh, I'm gonna go upload this video for you, and then I'm gonna go take the uh, snow off the uh, roof of the house. So anyway, uh, as always, uh, thanks for watching. Be safe, be warm, and uh, we'll see you soon. Take care.